Welcome to Laser Glow Technologies How To Video Series. Today we're going to learn how to use our Horizon Laser Level. The product comes in a durable carrying case made from hard plastic lined with dense foam on the inside. All the parts fit snug to hold securely in place during transit. The Laser Level kit includes the Laser Level, a laser receiver, a charger, the rechargeable lithium battery pack, a receiver mounting bracket, and a magnetic roof clip. To power the laser level on, we remove the battery cover which pops off. You can either use four AA batteries or the rechargeable battery pack that comes with the laser. I'm using the rechargeable battery pack here, which snaps in and locks in place. The battery pack features an LED screen to indicate the battery life. The laser is powered on using a switch on the side of the unit. There's a single button on the top that cycles the level between one of its four output settings. The first is a single horizontal line. The second is one horizontal and one vertical line. Third is two vertical lines. And fourth is four vertical lines and one horizontal line. Now I'll demonstrate how to use the receiver. The receiver takes two AA batteries and is used to locate where the level projection line is. It's particularly useful for setting a grade in construction projects. I've added a link to a couple videos in the description demonstrating the correct way to do this. To power it on, there's a power button located on the front. You can see here I've got a horizontal line projecting against the wall. As the receiver detector is moved close to the line, it begins to beep. When the receiver is level at the correct height, it beeps constantly. If it's above the line, it beeps fast to indicate that you need to move the receiver down. If it's below the line, it beeps slow to indicate that you need to move the receiver up. There's a second button next to the power button to cycle between a different beeping tone and no tone at all. When working in silent mode, there are small red LEDs that light up to indicate whether you need to move up or down. Now let's learn how to connect the mounting bracket to the receiver. On the back of the receiver, there's a threaded hole to attach the mounting bracket. This bracket is used to mount the receiver to a desired object or grade rod. I don't have a grade rod, but I'll demonstrate here by mounting it to a meter stick. Mounting the receiver to a grade rod is commonly used in grading applications. Once again, I've linked a couple videos in the description showing the correct way to use a laser level to set a grade. The laser level is self-leveling, and the beam will output continuously as long as it remains level. However, if the laser is placed on a sufficiently unlevel surface, the self-leveling mechanism will not be able to compensate, and the laser will flash on and off, indicating it's not level. If this occurs, the laser has three height-adjustable legs that can be adjusted until the beam outputs continuously, indicating the laser is level again. There is an optional tripod accessory that screws in at the base of the laser level. It has height adjustable legs and is hollow through the middle to allow the plumb dot to reach the ground. We'll now go through a couple simple applications. It can be used to align things level at a desired height. I'm demonstrating here using pictures, but this can be used to align any number of things in a construction project as a cutting or drill height guideline or a position guideline when installing electrical or plumbing. Here I'm projecting it on the roof which can be used to align light fixtures. We hope this gives you a better understanding of how to use your Horizon Laser Level. To learn more and to see our full line of Horizon Laser Level products, please visit our website at www.laserglow.com or give us a call to speak to one of our qualified sales associates.